So for given the limit x approaching 2, find the value of k. So here limit x approaching 2, x square minus k divided by 3x minus 6. So it's given like this. So we know that every time we do limit, something like this, uh, when we have fraction, we will factorize. Why we factorize? Because we wanted to eliminate the common factor. Because when you uh, else, if when you substitute, you will get zero. So you see here, so even here when you substitute, you get zero. So if you don't substitute, you will get zero over zero. So in this case, you get zero. That means you haven't uh, factorized yet. So which means that this one, this term you will get zero over zero because you haven't factorized yet. So we know that x is equal to 2. So here you get 2 square minus k is equal to 0. So k is equal to 4. So here k is equal to 4. So here in B, limit x approaching negative 1. So here x square minus 2x minus h divided by kx plus 2. This one is also the same one because you haven't uh, because you haven't uh, factorized anything. So when you direct substitute, you will get 0 over 0. So in this case, x square minus 2x minus h is equal to 0. And below is kx plus 2 is equal to 0. And you know that x is equal to negative 1. So here negative 1 square minus 2 negative 1 minus minus h is equal to 0. So 1 square is 1. Negative 2 times negative 1 is plus 2 minus h is equal to 0. So h is equal to, so h you move to the right, you get 1 plus 2 is 3. So in this case, x is equal to negative 1. So k negative 1 plus 2, you get 0. So negative k plus 2 is equal to 0. k is equal to 2. So h plus k is equal to 3 plus 2, then you get 5. Because that's why when we do limit, uh, that's why when we do limit, so we have to make sure that we don't get 0, 0.